something else I want to get into that I think is that I think has become the heart of the show is Patrick and David. Um, I mean, simply the best that the moment where he sings the, the acoustic song was a huge breakout moment for the show overall. Um, you know, w- what about that relationship do you think really struck a chord with, I mean, every, honestly, it felt like everyone watching this show and, and even beyond. Um, I think, I think it was, I think, I guess it was the fact that we didn't, approach that storyline any differently than you would a straight storyline. And I think as a gay person, I'm so used to seeing queer characters on television othered in some way, Mm -hmm. even if they're not intentionally. They're always sort of, the storylines are particularly love stories. It's almost as if you can almost see people being like, see? Look what we're, Mm -hmm. isn't that, or Or some sort of obstacle. Or anytime something good happens, someone dies. Totally. Um, So it was really my mandate to show as effortless a relationship or as casual a relationship as I could, a relationship that echoed my life, echoed my friends' lives, Mm -hmm. something that I wasn't seeing on TV. Mm -hmm. And and I think people responded to it. They responded to seeing themselves sort of through the characters. And it's a happy ending. Yeah. And we don't get a lot of those mm-hmm. on TV. We don't. And I think a lot of little boys and girls watching that will feel very, watching just the show, will feel very comfort, comforted by that. And I think another major moment that happened before the season was this billboard that went up. Um, we have it here. <laughs> and I mean, it's, it's just so special to see that. It gives you, it gives me, I just got chills just when that popped onto the, onto the screen. Um, I guess for honestly, for all, for all of you guys, what's it like being a part of a show that can have an impact beyond just being an amazing, funny TV show? Like this is a lot, like this billboard being up in, I think Los Angeles, it's, it's, a, it, it's, 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 it's really special. I, I can't wait till it's not a big deal. Yeah. And, and that it's just the way it is. Cause it is the way it should be. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, it really is a testament to the show, and really, it comes down to a love story is a love story. It's Definitely. In, in, without you know, without you know, waving any banners or you know, making it political or making an issue out of it. Tell the story, which is and which I think that's why I wanted this out mm-hmm. there because I think so much of it is just people are fearful of what they don't know, and the more you can put it out there in as broad stroke as this or as small as just a scene in our show, the more people become accustomed to what they see and they just, a lot of it is people don't know. Mm -hmm. And a lot of the letters we receive from people who had, you know, treated their kids or their brothers or their sisters or their cousins badly because they happened to be gay or queer, um, and they found a point of entry in the show. They found a way to understand. Mm -hmm. And I think people just need points of entry to understand. I think that's all we need in terms of how we, you know, see each other. We just need to empathize a little more. Mm -hmm. So this, I mean, the fact that it came in our last season, it was the greatest thing, I mean, for me on so many levels, Mm -hmm. but I think it's, it's the show in a nutshell. It's just unabashedly loving and joyful and unapologetic. Mm -hmm. 